Bussy in the morning, bussy in the evening, bussy at summertime. When you're grabbing bussy, you might end up doing time. Bussy in the morning, bussy in the evening, bussy at supper time. If you're grabbing bussy, you might end up doing time. So we are about to watch something I think that might be as crazy as Tiger King. We're gonna watch the trailer first and then we're gonna peep at the movie. But I think this is gonna be just as crazy as Tiger King's. It's on Hulu. Well, it is the eighth. So without further ado, well, what did y'all think about it? Are there fucks? Do we have a fuck? Are we interested? Oh, we got a fuck? Oh, good. Spaceship Earth. So we open with everybody getting ready to go into Biosphere 2. And this is in 1991. Oh, we taking it back 25 years earlier. So this heifer meets John Allen. He lived next door to her. She said she wanted to do something in this crazy book, like go to an island nobody had ever been to. And he said, oh, I'm building one. Come on. The pacing is not good, and we still don't know who this heifer is. So John Allen gathers the misfits, the confused, and the stylus and tells them, you know, come out to San Francisco. This is where it's going on planetarily. They said people do, were doing all sorts of things at that time while they show like people, you know, in the 70s, just, I mean, a real spasm, an induced spasm. I was like, oh, wow. They didn't need lean back then to get all crazy but they were a drug-free commune because they didn't want to blow it. Okay, um, this dancing that they're doing, this is not dance, this is, these are seizures, spasms, ticks. but this isn't dancing. That's not a dance. That's not a dance. And y'all weren't taking drugs. Well, then y'all was just crazy as it is. Because these, these dances need to be drug-induced. If this is really how your body moves, well, God help you. So ain't nobody fessing to fucking John Allen, but they had such a close friendship, but platonic. Mm -hmm. Platonic and the puss. Okay, so he pop up and asked to marry you, but y'all was platon -ton. So the commune gets together, and San Francisco was getting too pricey, so they head to New Mexico. And they called themselves Synergist and built a ranch. Girl, all this backstory, we get it, y'all, with some nutty boo hippie. So they get to building the dome, but damn, this music is putting me to sleep. This is not as good as Tiger King's. Oh my God. I mean, the if, let's see if we can fast forward 15 minutes and see if it picks up speed. Okay, good. Now we're, we're at the biosphere. I just skipped ahead to 50 minutes because, child, I don't need to know your backstory. You're nuts. You, you just doing all that. Girl, we got these cute little red jumpsuits they had on. Honestly, I'd wear that today. That would be real cute in the winter. I want one of those biosphere jumpers. Okay, now all that weird theater shit coming back to haunt John Allen. Some of the former Kanye members are telling the truth. Oh my God, Beyonce stole her Adidas designs from this shit. The piping and everything. Mm. Just slapped an Adidas logo on it. A th thieves gone steal. Oh, this theater. It's worse than improv. So they did a play where everything went wrong. So that way everything would go right in the biosphere. But clearly that didn't work. Ooh, I'm glad I skipped all that bullshit. They even fell out with the early leg up. You know what I just realized? They stopped filming white people dancing. You don't see rhythmless white people dancing anymore. They don't put that footage out. They used to have it all the time and we would just laugh and giggle, tee hee. My mom would call me in the living room, white people dancing, white people dancing. I run in there, we would just be howling, honey. And now they, they just, they realize, you know what, we're not even going to show that. Mm. I see you, news. I see you. I think we just saw some cat print. Cat print. Child, they couldn't even get the door shut, and that shit looked real flimsy. A tin tea. 
That shit wasn't airtight. That shit was off the hinge. So it's just the eight of them for two years in the biosphere with tacky plum carpeting. Ooh. It reminds me of an airport in Jersey. So we're going through the eight biospherians and two of them were couples before they already came in. Will the other two match up? This is a uh, spaceship Earth. Okay, so it's basically a bunch of people who are good, but also hacks. Uh-uh, Roy, don't nobody want to see your 60-year-old ass in a, in a Speedo. Oh, no. And I'm sorry, 60 what? That was 78 if it was a day. Ashley's husband looks better than you in the body. Not the face, but in the body. So carbon dioxide buildup is going to be a big issue that they got to worry about managing. So they open it up to visitors. I mean, they can't go in, but they can peep in. And they was hoping they'd make money, but they really didn't. And this young black kid said, why isn't there any multiculturalism inside? Because we ain't that stupid, boo. You young yet, you'll learn. You'll learn. We just saw scientists in their mud wrestling for the audience. Yeah, this some bullshit. Was Todd old enough to set this shit up? Okay, so somebody ended up hurting herself and um, they like, is she gonna leave? Did the heifer do it on purpose? It seemed like she might have. So she go to have quick surgery and come back and they thought it would be just a blip. This was the start of Big Brother. So this heifer brought in two duffel bags, but what did she sneak in? So since that half had hurt her hand, other people had to pick up her slack down on the farm. And it was pissing people off. Oh, child, they started fermenting bananas for wine. Brother, brother, pour the wine. So now the CO2 jumps. Was it because of some shit that heifer brought back? So shit's going wrong. The crops aren't coming in. So now all they can eat is beetroot. You better get the fuck out. Oh God, so the doctor's trying to use this as some type of, let's see if we could go on the air and beat diet and live to 120. It's not gonna work. So then the infighting starts, cause you know, they're getting brain damage from lack of, lack of oxygen. Oh God, John Allen told him, do some advanced yoga so you won't need as much oxygen. How, isn't yoga all about <sighs> idiot? Oh, she finally starts to resent John Allen. Well, you better walk on out. Y'all were having meetings with John via video. Meanwhile, John out in the world living it up. And y'all sucking it up. The CO2, that is. You ain't supposed to talk to scientists directly about oxygen. That's Darwinism right there. Okay, so there was a secret CO2 scrubber to remove CO2, and apparently that went against the whole idea of the project. I don't know. So that's what was fucking up. Okay, so John Allen talking about, <clears throat> well, we recognized climate change was a threat, and we were trying to counteract that. Yeah, but you were calf-cocked and put people's lives in danger because you were a cult leader. You gotta tell it like it is. Lord, now the place overrun with roaches. The beautiful wildlife is now dying. Mm. Them forests was cute. So some real scientists do some peer review on Biosphere 2. Oh, so somebody finally tells the truth. I thought John Allen was having paranoid Lulus, and I had to tell the board. The people in the Biosphere have pure Stockholm Syndrome. They mad that he told on them. So they finally had to pump some air from the outside in. I mean, y'all can go home at that point. You failed miserably. So the oxygen gave them a breath of fresh air. She gonna say it lifted a cloud. Yeah, of CO2, dummy. And you supposed to be a scientist. These heifers was doing some of the first TikToks. Oh, so they stayed the whole two years. For what? For what? The shit failed. Okay. So now all of a sudden, after the experiment, the marshals are showing up. Oh, the guy who bankrolled it went and got a court order and kicked all the incompetents out. Steve Bannon was involved in this. Staying in some shit. So then Ban becomes the CEO and locks away all the information or destroys it. I mean, we don't know if it was any good, but I'd still want to look at it. They've been anti-science since the giddy-up. 
Oh, God, these people still on the damn ranch. You know what? I ain't got no more to see. It, it was shitty boo. I thought it was going to be much more interesting. It was and shitty boo. Don't grab my pussy. Don't grab my pussy. I'm your cameraman. I don't want to be anything more to you. I swear. Don't grab my pussy. I'm not attracted to you. You look like Yoda and the Gollum.